you, you can add to that an application principle that says, well, I, I really am concerned about carbs, so I'm going to carb cap in addition to that. So I'm going to not exceed a certain amount of carbs, and I am going to try to you know, emphasize the better quality carbs. You can take that a step further and say, well, now I'm going to put a more severe carb cap on it to instill ketosis. So now I'm less than 50, less than 20, wh whatever that number is, so that you can get to a, a ketotic state. All right. And then as I'm doing that, uh, what are the macronutrients that are taking up the burden that aren't being satisfied by carb capping? Right now I'm, I'm taking in more fats. Well, what kind of fats are you taking in? Are you taking in a blend of polys and monos and saturated fats? Um, is there any uh, attention to detail as to how much saturated fat? Or are you going out of your way to add saturated fat? And there are some people who would do that. Right. And unfortunately, all of those things have their own nuances and impact on what you should expect to see.